Hi there everyone, my name is Pritam and I welcome you all to this channel. In this video, we will be introducing you with Microsoft Project. Microsoft Project is a top-notch project management software and maybe you are already aware of because you are watching this video. And um, you also wanted to know how we can download and install. So generally Microsoft Project do not come predefined or pre-bundled with Microsoft Office 365 package until or unless you have bought it so in this video i'm going to show you how you can download and install um, trial version of microsoft project online 3 which also comes with offline package and i would say one month of trial period would be sufficient enough for anyone to try if it is a good choice in your use case scenario or not and then guess what I'm going to also show you how you can increase or extend your trial period. So without further ado, let's jump into our computer screen. And there we go. Here just I have opened Microsoft Edge browser that comes pre-installed in your Windows device. Now after opening Microsoft Edge, here I'm going to type Microsoft project and then I'm going to say plan 3 and um, let's click on it which is buy link and not to worry guys i'm going to also provide you this link so that you can directly reach to this page and then since i am from india so that's why um, i am opening this enin link but if i write here en us then probably it's going to take me to the us website but in my particular case i think uh, you know it would be more appropriate if i choose this indian one and then no matter whether you are from US or EMEA or any other reason, the process of getting this free one month trial is going to remain same. So all we need to do here is we need to click on this try free for one month, which will basically take you to this page. So here what we need to do is we need to enter our email address. So now let me type here my personal email address, which is live.com. And then I am entering here Microsoft address, not the normal one. And then we need to click here on next. Now, after clicking on next here, you need to fill up your general information. For example, here we can see first name, last name, your job title, phone number. And please make sure that the phone number that you are entering here can receive OTP. And like this, you can fill up all the remaining data. Then click on next then we need to click on send verification code and then here you need to enter the verification code or otp that you have received then click verify after verifying your account here you need to create a username and password so just create a username and password so that we can get a free trial of microsoft project now after entering all the required detail the next step will be uh, you know entering your address so please enter your address at least uh, those which have got the star sign and after entering your address you need to provide your registration number which could be your company tax id or in case of india it is your pan number so i would suggest you to simply add your pan number and then here again the next screen talk about entering credit card information so i would suggest you to enter your credit card information and then um, let's say you do not want to continue further i'm gonna also show you how one can cancel the subscription so just enter your detail here and click on save then the next step is again um, it is asking us to confirm our detail so just confirm detail or still you have opportunity to uh, make some changes after you confirm your payment information the next thing here is you need to validate your card so for that microsoft will deduct two rupees from your credit card account after entering your otp here i can see a message which says thanks for signing up for planner and project plan 3 trial so now let's click on get started okay so here i can see i have got this trial 
but um, let's say you just want to have trial and you do not want your payment to be deducted automatically in that situation you can basically go here and uh, click on subscription and then here you should able to see your subscription so this is our subscription and then um, by clicking here you can cancel it and then here you just need to select any reason and then um, click on cancel subscription and in this way guys you will able to cancel your subscription and here we just need to click on this open project and here we go um, now what we can do here is we can click on new plan and then we have got these bunch of templates you can start with blank plan a roadmap and import project as a plan so let's start with a simple a normal project management which is the second one and let's click on use template and here a project may take some time to be created and there we go here we can see this very basic waterfall type of project and it also support kanban board uh, which means that you are free to move any task from planning to executing and so on then if we click on timeline here we can see how these all are connected and the good thing about project online is that you can invite your entire team or even external stakeholders and then they can also adjust or uh, you know mark their work as done and so on then here we also have got this chart of which i would say um, microsoft project have taken inspiration from their uh, lower end project which is planner and then um, here we can see peoples involved and then here we can uh, basically add our plan and then here one can define goal now let's talk about how we can get it offline for that i'm gonna go here on office 365 Now we need to click on this install Microsoft 365 apps. And now this will take us to this page, um, which is portal.office.com. And then uh, we need to click on view apps and devices. And then here we have got this install projects. So let's click on it. And there we go. Now let's click on open and run this setup. Now let's wait for a while for the process to get completed. And finally here we can see we have successfully installed it. So now let me click on close and um, let me type here project and here I can actually see it before even typing. Uh, but here we can see we do have now project offline installed. And um, now I need to click here on sign in or create email account which is the one that we have just created so i'm gonna type it here the same and then let's click on next then password and there we go now here we have successfully signed in and if i go here in account i can see here it is successfully installed now let me click here on home now let me also restart it um, so that i can see the project that I have worked with in online it should also appear there and in this way guys you can also install Microsoft project offline as well and that's all guys from my side in this video I hope that you find this video helpful and informational if so then please do like and subscribe to Technoholic to see more such content related to office productivity and I will catch you soon with one such another video till then you take care and bye bye